Alright there guys, Axeman here with a tutorial of how to install Hogcraft version 2 and 1 I guess for um, on, well, Mac on OS X. Um, I'm using a uh, line I think it is. I'm not sure, I've only just got my Mac so still getting to grips with it. Um, so yeah, I didn't do one at the time of releasing Hogcraft because I didn't have a Mac, didn't know how to install it. Um, but now that I've got one, I found out how I can install it. It's a bit more complicated than it is on Windows. Um, but, well, hopefully I explain it in a way that you can understand. So basically, those of you who have used Windows on Minecraft, you know there's a specific folder which has got all the Minecraft stuff in it, which you can just easily, print, well, pretty easily access. Now, there's the same sort of folder on OS X, however, it's a, it's a bit difficult to access. It's in, well, within your user area, there's a folder called library, and it's in there, but this library folder is hidden. So, the re so to get Hogcraft installed, we have to get to that folder, and, uh, to get to that, it's pretty simple now. You should go to go, um, go to folder, and what you need to do is you need to have a slash user and then slash your username slash library, and that will get you into the hidden folder. And this is where basically all um, all the dependencies um, of the applications go, basically, which Apple likes to keep cleared away so you don't have to see it and deal with it. Um, but yeah, so if you didn't see there, go into application support in that folder. And then there you can see we have our Minecraft folder. Now over here I'm going to open up Hogcraft folder as well. And simply all you have to do is move the correct stuff into the right place. So here we have saves. So we're going to map files, drag in Hogcraft. Uh, sort that. And we're going to texture packs. Go into the texture pack on here. Drag the zip folder in. So that's it. We can close these down now. And all I gotta do now is open up my Minecraft. Uh, let it log in. And uh, this will work for any. Um, even though Minecraft's updated more since this, uh, since the map was made, this will still work on them because, well, basically, uh, none of the new sort of features are used in the version 2. They'll all be in version 3 of the map. So, as you can see, you've got the Hardcraft Texture Pack. And I've got the Hogcraft single player world. Now because it was released before the Anvil map mode was released, it does need to be converted. But it's nothing to worry about. It'll still be per work perfectly fine afterwards. So I'll just skip ahead this bit because it does take maybe a minute or two. Okay, so uh, as you can see here, we have our converted world working perfectly, pretty much. Um, yeah, so here we have Hogcraft version 2 working on OS X. All the features still work exactly the same as it does on Windows, etc. Um, so yeah, um, now if you didn't before, you can uh, play Hogcraft on your Mac easily. And uh, yeah, so uh, thanks for watching guys. And uh, remember to stay tuned for news on Hogcraft version 3. And uh, don't forget to give this a like so uh, other people who are a bit confused on the situa situation can find out how to install maps and stuff like that and texture packs, etc. So I shall see you guys later.